All right, what is going on, guys? And welcome to the first episode, even though I'm pretty sure I'm going to name this episode zero because my friends aren't in it. But welcome to the first episode of the Smithify podcast. So, yeah, we decided to start a podcast. This is something that I've just been, I've been wanting to do it for a long time, but I've never just had that initiative. And recently, a couple friends just were joking about starting a podcast. And I was like, well, well, let's do it. I've always wanted to do this for a while and let's get into it. So, basically, what we're going to do this podcast is deep discussions, hopefully. And we just give each other's takes on things, and then we give feedback. And, you know, the point of this podcast is really just like a couple of years down the line from now, I'm going to be looking back at this, and I'm going to be like, wow, that kid was either really stupid or he had some very wise words to say. And I just love that we have the ability to do that now with podcasts nowadays. So, uh, hello, future me. You're probably listening to this right now. I mean, <laughs> whatever you're doing, welcome. This is the Sminify Podcast, Episode 1. Or episode zero, as I'm probably going to name it by the title. But yeah, we're probably going to get some very deep discussions going. That's the goal of this. We don't want to just talk about like very basic subjects. We want to get an interesting, deep thought, thought-provoking questions that we will be answering. Uh, this solo or this episode's solo, but usually I'm going to have a couple friends on, and we might even start getting guests depending on how this goes. So, uh, first of all, this is our 20 subscriber special. So like, <laughs> we've been growing so crazily for the last like couple days and now i mean at the time of recording this i have 47 subs i don't know when this is going to go live we're going to have to probably pre-record a few more episodes of the of me talking with my friends right now this is just the first episode i recorded we we tried to uh, record an episode of me talking with my friends the other night and that did not go very well <laughs> we did we were not prepared at all and we just we just scrapped that i mean uh it started on short notice they gave me 10 minutes to set up everything that ended up turning into two and a half hours so that didn't turn out well and then just the content was just terrible so <laughs> We're just going to have to redo that. So that currently this is the only thing that I have recorded for this podcast, so I have absolutely no clue when this is coming out. But just remember, this is the 20 subscriber special. So thank you all so much for 20 subscribers. It means a lot. And thank you so much. And so our schedule for this podcast. So, you know, this will probably be a weekly thing, but I don't know. It depends how it does. I mean, it's really going to be up to us how many we can get out a week. I'm hoping once a week at the at the least, I suppose. But or, yeah, that'd be nice to get at least once a week and not like once a month. So I'm hoping it be kind of a regular thing. We get quite a few episodes in because the more we get in, the more we can come back and listen to when we're older. Because that's really the only point I'm doing this for. Like, I want to come back down the road like 10 years from now and listen to my like my 10 year younger self talking about issues and seeing what I know about them. It's, it's such an interesting concept. And I love that we can do that nowadays. So I just this is why it's really the only reason why I'm having this podcast. It's going to be awesome. So. Uh, let's see here. I have a, I have these ten little bullet points here that I wrote down because I'm not very good at just coming up with stuff off my mind. So, let's see here. What do we got here? Plans for the channel. All right. So currently the channel is actually just booming. It's kind of going off. I mean, relatively. I mean, right now I have 47 subs, but when you think about it, like a couple days ago we had 20. That is some exponential growth right there. So, right now I want to thank all you guys so much for watching, tuning in, and listening. It's awesome. Uh, you guys have been very active in the comments, so that's amazing. That's the best part about being a creator, to be honest. Like, I've been creating videos since like 2013, I think, is when I started my first channel. And those, <laughs> I started, I'm sure I have a similar story to many other people. I just started with the iPod, fourth generation or whatever, just recording the TV screen, throwing some just terribly copyrighted music over it. Oh my gosh, it was terrible. And then just taking off from there. And uh, my old channel got up to oh, almost 600 subscribers, and then we just, lost passion to keep recording videos and that channel eventually died out and then I just thought it was time to start fresh so this is what I started with and this channel started about well a year ago and I lost the passion again to upload videos after uploading like four and then this channel died out but now I just realized like I got to get back on this grind I love just making content uploading YouTube videos and the best part is just the feedback and like you guys have been awesome leaving comments on all my videos like literally if you just leave anything like good video that's just, that means so much to me it's absolutely amazing getting feedback that's definitely the best part about making videos and entertaining people hopefully which they find good entertainment <laughs> that's that's the ideal state but uh, right now it's like it's so hard to make it in YouTube right now because like back back when I started in like 2013 like the standard was so low it was like everybody was just recording their stream with iPod fourth generations and just putting terribly copyrighted music over it. that's what old YouTube's known for is just those cringy intros and outros oh man that was terrible and nowadays everybody's just got thousands of dollars worth of setup like microphones desks computers and it's just very hard to compete in today's YouTube and Sometimes it'd just be nice to go back to the old days because the old days were much, much simpler. But you know what? You just got to accept that we can't go back into the old days. And as much as I'd like to, they're gone and we just got to move on. Like 
even it's crazy like 2017 i have nostalgia for because like Fortnite came out in 2017 and like that seems so long ago and oh my god i already find that nostalgic and that was only three years ago so it's amazing how fast things get old and how much we want them back after just a couple of years so we just got to take things while they come and we just got to enjoy it while they last because like Fortnite is literally just the example we did not know what we had like all of us probably everybody listening to this just had their squad they hopped on with every night and just Oh man, those are the best times ever. Fortnite in its prime was definitely one of the best games ever. I I believe it was incredible, and like everybody was terrible, no sweats. It just it made it made the Fortnite experience so much better when you don't get when nobody's cranking nineties on you, you don't get boxed in and trap killed. <laughs> Bush camping was much better back in the day, much much better. So anyway, yeah, this is a podcast now. A few reasons why I'm doing the podcast. Once again, it's just very interesting, thought provoking. And I really want to get into some deep subjects and just, like, relate more personally with you guys. But, again, the main reason I'm doing this is because, like, I'm kind of just doing it for myself, man. Like, right now I'm not the best at, like, conveying ideas and stuff and, like, starting conversations and speaking. So (laughs) I'm hoping that this podcast can help me do that and help me get better in those fields and just help me come up with things on the top of my mind. So I hope you find it very entertaining and nice and I hope I can get a lot of friends on here and we can have a lot of discussions and we can have some very interesting episodes. Like I already have a few friends that I have very deep discussions with. So, and we've just been doing it over like text messaging and we were like, like, why don't we just bring this into a podcast format so everybody else can hear what we think and give us feedback. And it's just, again, incredible, man. I just, I love podcasts so much. And I just, I mean, our podcast isn't really going to be like professional in any way. Like I'm taking inspiration from the Smith squad podcast. For those of you that don't know, the Smith plays, he's a YouTuber, probably 2 million subscribers. And he just started just like not a professional podcast at all. He just sat down with his microphone. He would just talk about call of duty, Minecraft life. And it's just, it's truly is an amazing podcast. So, I mean, in a way I'm definitely trying to replicate him and the way he just, his podcasts were so interesting, but I don't know if I could do that. He's a pretty interesting, pretty interesting person. He's got, he's pretty good with, with his words. And I don't think I'm anywhere near as good as him, but see, that's the point I'm trying to improve and get better at this. And I think it'll be easier once I get people to talk with. Right now, I'm just sitting here solo trying to keep the conversation going, which is something I'm just terrible at. Keeping conversations going is not my strong suit, so that's that's what we're aiming for. We're going to try to improve this and make it better. So, well, that, that I mean, <laughs> I was hoping these 10 bullet points would last me, you know, 20, 30 minutes, but <laughs> looks like we're already through all of them, so that's just, that, that's interesting. So, uh, if you guys have any, like, recommendations that you want to leave in the comments of videos or anything that's that's awesome i'll definitely listen to that like some people have already been like giving ideas for minecraft builds and i really love that feedback mechanism that you guys give and then tell me what you want because then i know what i can upload and what people will like uh but on this channel we're not going to be confined to playing like one game like i i don't want to just be a minecraft youtuber that would be absolutely terrible uh, i hope just you know call of duty minecraft tutorial videos funny videos just guides just Everything like that. I just want to be a channel where everybody can just do everything. We can all be real. Like the thing with YouTube right now, this this day and age, unfortunately, there's just so many people out there making just absolutely terrible content that's getting so many views. Like J Station recently had a scandal where he literally faked a video where his girlfriend died and got millions of views. And then, oh my God, it's just absolutely terrible. The 3 a.m. morning experiments, social experiments gone wrong, gone sexual. It's just. These videos are so terrible, and I'm just trying to restore the OG side of YouTube where nothing is cancerous and just terrible and everything. We can all just come here, chill, enjoy, and I respect every single one of you guys and respect what you guys have to say. So once again, leave opinions down in the comments, please. <laughs> that is very helpful. So that's really the main point of this channel. That's what that's what we're trying to accomplish here at Smitty because like, I'm just i really just getting sick of this new way that YouTube is ran. I mean... So many contents out there with just massive all capital titles, like, and then on the top of the screen, it's enter giveaway. You have five seconds to like, and it's just, it's so stupid. Like, if people will like the video, if they want to like the video, you can't tell them to like the video before they even watch the video. And I just hate that so much, and it works so well on all the young children, unfortunately. So, once again, that's what we're trying to eliminate on this channel, and that's what we want to do. And well, let's see some goals for my channel. So, like, on YouTube, like, people nowadays, it's just all about the money. There's a lot of, like, kids that are here just starting channels for the money. They just want to make some money, you know, start the streams. The first thing they do is make a stream lab so you can go donate to them. And it's just, like, that's awesome. Like, money, you know, it's a part of it. Like, I currently don't make any money off YouTube, obviously. But you got to get quite a few views to be doing that. But, like, 
that, if money's your main drive, you're just, you're not going to do good on YouTube because like, like right now my main drive is, it's definitely not money whatsoever. It's definitely the feedback that people give me. I love the fact that I can make videos that people will watch. That's something, that's a new concept. I mean, for multiple years on the Gaming Ninja Turtles, which was my old channel, I uploaded videos that nobody watched except myself. And I just liked with all my like four accounts and then <laughs> clicked the refresh button to give myself views. And that's just, that's just not the way to go. And it's just terrible. So on this channel, once again, feedback is awesome, guys. Uh, please, I'm just doing it for you guys. If you have any uh, any suggestions for videos whatsoever, I'm definitely going to listen because what you guys want is what you guys want. And I'll post what you guys want, but I'm also going to post what I want. So I'm going to try to keep an, an even balance mix in between us because I don't want to just become a channel that just posts Minecraft tutorials or just posts Call of Duty Black Ops Zombies, as I stated earlier, because that is... That's a terrible trap to get yourself into, and I'm just going to try to not do that because that's going to be very difficult to come out of because, like, recently the Smith plays, he's also, he's just gotten to a bunch of Fortnite content, and all I did was post Fortnite, and then he used to post Call of Duty Zombies, and that did great for him. Then Call of Duty Zombies died, unfortunately, as probably many of us know, and the whole Call of Duty franchise pretty much died at this point, which is also depressing. But eventually Call of Duty Zombies died for him, and then he had to find a new platform, and he went on to Fortnite, and... Well, Fortnite did amazing. He was, his channel was doing the best it ever had when he switched over to Fortnite. But then eventually, he took a month off, and now he's just known as the Fortnite guy. And then he tried to go back to zombies, and his zombies videos get like half the views that his Fortnite videos do. And I'm sure that panics him because he's he's at his point, he's definitely just making a living off of YouTube. His full time job is YouTube, so he's definitely he's definitely very reliant on the income part of the YouTube um, progress. So. He's definitely going to just have to post Fortnite now, and it's just it's a sad trap to get yourself into, so I'm just going to definitely try to stay away from that because I don't want to be known as just the Minecraft guy, just the Minecraft tutorial guy, just the Roblox guy. I want to post it all. I want to try to get multiple communities together because I think that's just the best way we can collide and just share ideas and just get to know each other because, like, hello, all you Roblox fans. Meet the Minecraft players. Meet the Call of Duty players, and we can all just have a good time and just talk in the comments. I mean... I definitely I'll respond to like every single comment on my channel because I just once again it's it's the best part of YouTube is the fact that me sitting here can make a video, put it out there, and then unlimited amount as many people as who have an electronic device can find that video instantly. It's just absolutely incredible. It's amazing what we have today, and that just comes back to how amazing and how innovative technology has been, which is just incredible. And I'm so interested in making these videos and so passionate, and I just love doing it so much. It's so much fun. And just that feedback system that you guys give makes it like 5,000 times better. So thank you all for that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So once again, like keeping conversations going is definitely not my strong suit. And right now I've already went through all 10 of my bullet points. And I'm just gonna I'm just gonna try to get better at this. That's the point of the podcast. Get better at speaking, because uh, I could definitely use work in that. And yeah, get better at sharing ideas. And this is probably going to be a shorter podcast than the other ones. I think we're going to be going for an hour long on most of our podcasts. That might get a little long, but I really have no clue since we haven't recorded any yet because, as I said, the first one was a, just a complete disaster. I mean, like, I talked to my friend Nacho. He says, all right, we're doing a podcast in 10 minutes. I was like, all right, uh, okay, no, no forewarning. We're just going. And then it took me two hours to get the setup going because – that's why it's good to be prepared, people. It is very good to be prepared. And he gave me no time to prepare, and that's what he got, a two-hour two hour wait. And then it was like 10.30, and we started the first episode of the Smithify podcast with him and Matt. And we just we just, we were all tired, and I was trying to not be heard, and it just it didn't work out well whatsoever. It was just absolutely terrible. So, yeah, that was just a complete disaster. Absolutely awful. So yeah, but definitely I'm going to be getting friends on the podcast. Definitely Matt and Nacho. They're probably going to be on here a lot. And you guys will definitely hear a lot from them, a lot from their views. We have very differing views, which is hopefully going to make the podcast very interesting, very spicy. And hopefully we can get into some deep thought pr thought provoking uh, concepts, thought pr provoking questions. I already know me and Nacho, we like argue on literally everything like every other night on, on text messages. So we just got to uh, convert that into words, and then hopefully we start a good podcast. So the Smithify podcast we came up with, which, oh my God, that name took so long to make, the Smithify podcast. I don't even know if it's good. If you guys think it's good, you can leave it down in the comments. But like originally I thought the Smitty Speaks podcast, but then I was like, that's kind of self-centered. That just sounds like I just I just have control over everything, and that then I wouldn't really be able to have guests on or have my friends talk about stuff because I don't want it to be that self-centered. And then we had the Shattered Dreams podcast, which, I mean, it 
it really just doesn't make much sense shattered dreams it we just tried to do that to have it stick out but so we shot that down and then we went with the no regrets podcast and then we we realized all of us are like in an age range from 17 to 21 so how many regrets could we possibly have we still have our whole lives ahead of us <laughs> so we found a few flaws in those names and then eventually nacho was just like the sminify podcast let's go with it and i was like you know what <laughs> let's do it and so that was an hour and 15 minutes in discord that's what we came up with the sminify podcast so yeah that's what we got done <laughs> Good stuff, good stuff. This is just the uh, pilot episode, I guess you could call it. It's going to be episode zero because usually I'm going to have friends on, and right now I'm just solo, so I just thought I'd lay the foundation down for what we're going to be doing with this podcast and what my goals are for it and what my plans are for it. I mean, if you guys enjoy listening to it, that's awesome. I mean, one, one of the goals is obviously just have you guys just turn it on, go sit down, play a game of zombies, play some Minecraft, and just let me talk on the background while you guys just play games. That's that's exactly what I did with the Smith Plays podcast, and that's it's kind of one of the goals I have for this podcast. But I don't know if I'm as good as him, and I don't know if we'll be as interesting as him. So, but you know what? We'll try. And then obviously, obviously, I can't wait. Ten years from now, I'm gonna be looking at this right now, and I'm just gonna either be like in tears, crying, like why you're so stupid, you're gonna make so many dumb decisions, or I'm just gonna be like, you you have very wise words to say. You actually have somewhat of an idea of what you're doing, and it's just. It's just so interesting with the way of technology now because, like, I have videos of me from, like, 2013, and that's already seven years ago, and that's it's just incredible that I can see myself seven years ago. Like, the first videos I ever made on YouTube were me, like, okay, everybody knows who Dude Perfect is, the guys who do, like, basketball trick shot videos and just trick shots of everything. I mean, they literally have water bottle flip trick shots and, like, frisbee trick shots. Like, obviously, they were a huge inspiration for me back in, like, 2013, so I decided to make my own trick shot videos, and I titled them the Hot Shot videos, and those, <laughs> they weren't too bad well done. I mean, for being shot on an iPod fourth generation and being made on iMovie on that iPod, they were pretty well made, and ever since I started making those videos, I just had this, just this spark that when I make a video, it's just so much fun. The fin like, viewing the finished result, just, it makes me happy almost, just watching my video and then when people come and watch it and leave comments on it that is just <laughs> that makes the feeling 5,000 times better so it's just that satisfaction of getting videos out to you guys and you guys enjoying them and that's literally the reason why I do this it's so it's so much fun so much fun so yeah that's that's the goals of the podcast I mean probably weekly you know this is the 20 subscriber special again I mean <laughs> it's actually funny because like a year ago was the last time I uploaded my video before I started grinding again right now. And like a year ago I had 12 subscribers and a year ago I just I just had this idea like let's just throw in the description uh, 20 subscriber special please is on the way and I didn't have any plans for it whatsoever because my channel was so small. It was so hard to gain subscribers so I had no idea that I would ever even hit 20 subscribers. So I just threw that down there just because <laughs> just to try to get somebody excited and subscribe and like that was a year ago. <laughs> And then finally, like this year, a year later, I finally hit 20 subscribers. So now we can bring the 20 subscriber special to you guys. And I had, once again, I had no plans leading up like a week ago to what the 20 subscriber would special would be. And now here we are making a podcast because this is something I've always wanted to do. And I never had, I never had that spark to get it done until recently some friends said they would do it with me. And I said, let's do it. I mean, it's kind of funny. It kind of started out as a joke. We were just playing Overwatch, me, Matt, and Nacho, and they were like, if we ever started a podcast, we would call it the Shattered Dreams Podcast. And I was like, you know what? You guys want to start a podcast? Let's do it. We're not going to call it the Shattered Dreams Podcast, though. That's not that's not going to do it. We're not a bunch of dark emo people. We don't we don't have depressing lives. We're not depressed. I mean, <laughs> they were going for that very just depressed vibe. And I was like, bro, we just got it. We just got to call it something generic. I wanted Smitty in the title, but I didn't want it to be too self-centered. So Smittify is what we came up with. Smitty Speaks was too self-centered, but... I think Smithify sounds all right, and <laughs> it should be a fun time. So I'm definitely going to get getting them on on episode one, which we might record later tonight, hopefully. And hopefully it goes better than the first recording. That first recording was just absolutely terrible. We just I figured out it's it's very good to be prepared for things. Like I'm a person I just I like to write things down before I do it. I hate winging things. If I wing things, it just doesn't work out well. I like to like watch a video on how to do it before I do it. I like to write it down and get a script read out written out. Like right now, I'm just thinking everything off my mind, which I'm just terrible at, which is probably why I'm like mumbling, stumbling over my words a lot. And that's why one of the goals I'm trying to fix with this podcast is me just speaking better and enunciating my words better. But yeah, so when we tried to do our first podcast, it was just abs it was just an absolute disaster. Like we were just like, all right, let's do it. Let's go. 
no topics whatsoever. It took us like 10 minutes before I got the courage to finally say, hey guys, welcome to the Smithify podcast. <laughs> it just, it didn't work out at well. So moral of the story, just be prepared for everything. I don't care what it is. If you're prepared, you're going to look a lot better. Like this podcast right now I'm recording, I think is a lot better than the first one that we recorded. I don't know how it's going to sound when I play it back, but right now I think it's been going a lot better than the first one we recorded, which isn't saying much because that first one is just terrible. And the difference is that I was prepared for this one. So being prepared versus not being prepared, huge difference. I mean, this one's probably going to be the final result. This is probably going to be uploaded. If you're watching this on YouTube right now, what's up? Thank you so much for making it this far in because if you're listening to me talk ramble for this long, that's incredible. That means I must be doing something right. The first one, scrap that, threw it away, threw it in the trash bin, goodbye. Be prepared. It was absolute disaster. And yeah, so <laughs> I hope this one's going a lot better now that we're finally prepared for an episode. So want to record our first real episode, episode one tonight or whenever. I'm definitely going to go in with some topics and we're going to have an actual discussion and we're going to be prepared because that's, that's, that's the way to roll. So yeah, uh, let's see. Right now on my channel banner, it says I'm on Twitch. That's that's false advertising. I'm gonna have to get that down eventually. I've I've given up on Twitch. I used to think that Twitch was the way to go, but then I realized it's just it's so difficult to make it on Twitch because like everybody's doing the exact same thing. Everybody's streaming Fortnite. Everybody's streaming COD. Everybody's just Minecraft. Like you really have to stick out on Twitch to be good, and it's just it's so hard to stick out on live stream because. Like, all live streams are the exact same thing, and it really, you have to go off personality then, which is what sets live streams apart, and <laughs> I don't think my personality would stick out above, like, Tfue or Ninja or, like, Tim the Tapman or anybody like that, because, <laughs> first of all, I can't put, like, face cam on because I just sit in a recliner when I play games, so I don't have this $50 million setup with LED lights in the back. <laughs> what is up with those LED lights, bro? And it's... <laughs> So I just don't have any of that. So I, I could not make it on Twitch. So YouTube is the way to go, hopefully, because I've just had passion to make it on YouTube in a long time. And I just hope I can get a nice a nice little community built here with this Smitty058 channel. And it's got me excited, man. The future's got me excited. I can't really can't wait to see where this Smitty channel takes me. Like, I mean, not like a future like career in this. Like, obviously not that. But, like, just... Like, I think I finally got, like, some, I got the momentum going. Like, I'm getting, like, a couple subscribers a day, which is incredible. That's an awesome thought to have. Just one or two a day, that's that's awesome. We can keep that pace going forever. That's amazing. But it's just something I've always wanted to have happen. And it's finally kind of coming true. And, like, I, the reason I started this channel is because, like, I got a year and a half left till I graduate. And I was like, you know what? Let's just, I got, I'm trying to get as much stuff in before I graduate here from high school because, like, like, if I didn't do this, I'd probably regret it. I'd be like, why didn't I start the Smitty058 channel up again? And now I'm just, here I am. I'm trying to get it going. I'm trying to upload every day, if not every other day. And I'm just having a blast, man. It's it's so much fun just uploading these videos and seeing them get views and comments and feedback and some dislikes and some likes. And it's so much fun. I love making, like, opinionate, opinionated, opinionated <laughs> videos where I just tell my side and then you guys can argue in the comments and... I've only done two of those so far, but I have plans to do a lot of those, mainly on like COD and Minecraft, because those are the two big games that I've played. So that's that's gonna be awesome. And like, all right, hold on. What what, what is up with TikTok these days? I'm just like, what do y'all think of TikTok? TikTok TikTok is just honestly, it's it's to me right now, it's the second best social media app. Like behind YouTube, it's the second most entertaining app on here, dude. TikTok is just it's so good. Like people will say it's recycled content, but honestly, man. I tell you what, like some people just, they'll, they'll make you think that they're doing the recycled content and then they'll just have a huge, huge, uh, change of events and they'll just completely switch it on you and change it up. It's so much, it's so funny, dude. TikTok's hilarious. And I've seen some very inner, I've seen like people of all types and races and gender identities and looks and height and size on TikTok. It's just, everybody's on TikTok, man. I've seen it all. TikTok really exposes you to just all different types of people and it's a great platform for that and it's just it's incredible and it's so much fun to play all right well <laughs> it's probably about time to start wrapping this up i'm really just at this point i'm just trying to ramble on for longer than i should i'm not good at this hopefully i get better and it'd be a lot easier to do this if i had friends so again this is just the first pilot episode i suppose you can call it i think that's what we'll call it i mean it's really gonna be called episode zero of the smitty speaks or the, the smittified podcast sorry i still don't have that down we just we just came up with that last night, so I'm still getting used to saying that, the Sminified podcast, because Smitty Speaks is the podcast that I had in my mind, the title that I had in my mind for like a long time, and then we went with Sminified, so I like that name. Uh, anyway, this is 
episode zero. This is just getting an intro, a taste, what our goals are, our goals. Hopefully entertain you guys. Hopefully a couple years from now I'm watching this myself and I'm reflecting on this. And self-reflection is very important. And it's incredible that we have the ability nowadays to record ourselves and see what we thought years ago and then compare it to what we feel in the present. So even like a couple months from now, I'll probably be watching this. When school's out, I'll be like, wow, this kid just has no idea what's about to hit him. And it's, it's going to be awesome. So anyway, this has been the first episode or the episode zero of the Spinified Podcast. If you guys like or hype, leave a like. I guess I don't really care if you leave a like. Whatever. Thank you all for watching. Spinified Podcast. Peace out. Let's go, baby.